What's going on everybody? Welcome to my channel. Today I just want to make this quick little video, mostly to test out my new toy. I finally got me a microphone. I made myself a deal when I started this channel that I wouldn't put any money into it until there was interest. And I set a goal of like 100 subscribers and then I would get one. Well, as of the making of this video, I have 106. And thank you, thank you all. So, I want to test this thing out and let's uh, see how many of you get this reference near. Far. Near. Far. <laughs> All right, <clears throat> enough of the shenanigans. Uh, what I want to make this video about today is uh, an underused tool, I think, and I call it the walking stick. No, not that kind. This kind. Now, I think that there actually is a difference between a walking stick and a trekking pole. If I had to guess, this is probably more of a trekking pole. But I was thinking one of the uh, things to look for in survival gear and outdoor gear is stuff that has more than one use. And uh, this thing here <coughs> can be used, obviously, as a walking stick, trekking pole. It can also be used as a splint in an emergency. And uh, you can even use it as an emergency tent pole or even a sundial. You can stick it in the ground. And you know, do the whole sundial trick, which maybe I'll do one day. But something I added to it here probably close to 10 years ago was this little button compass right here. And of course, we all know button compasses aren't great, but it might help you find your cardinal directions and get you in the general direction and hopefully get you rescued. So let's take this thing over there. I'm going to stick it in the ground and see how well it works. <clears throat> <clears throat> okay, mix things up a little bit here, and it does have this nice little point on it. I've already had it in the ground, and it did come with a little safety cover for that. Anyway, you're stuck in the ground there. Gotta get the button level. One of the problems of button compasses. There we go. That's pretty good. That'll get you where you're going. May not be pinpoint accuracy like real land nav, but it'll work. About a year or so ago, I seen this uh, trekking pole hiking stick thing on a different channel that uh, had all kinds of survival kit. Stuff that was down inside these tubes. I don't really think that's an option to make this into one because this is just a cheapo walking stick. I mean, made in China. I don't even know who makes this. Outdoor products, it says. Pretty sure I got it at Walmart. But anyway, one of those uh, walking sticks got all the cool stuff in it. I mean, that thing was outstanding. But I think it was like 300 bucks. So who's going to do that? And. Uh, I'm definitely not going to spend that kind of money. And here comes the car, so let's let the car go by. Uh, I should have taken my neighbor up on his offer or let me record back on his land. Maybe I wouldn't have all these interruptions. I don't even know where I was going now with talking about that uh, $300 survival thingy. It was neat and I can't afford it, so you know, I worked with him. Anyhow, thank you for watching and uh, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. See you next time.